Hello and welcome to Hexa Plays Neo Doom. And yes, it has been quite a while, and you know what that means. A bit more talking, a bit more what have I been up to recently, and so and so and so and forth. So, um, yeah, I owe you all a bit of a chatter explanation as to what's been going down in the last couple of months. So, I've been quite busy, but I have not been uh, forgetting of the channel, okay? I'm, I know what, I've been looking, I'm reading all the comments, looking to see what's going on, and... You know what? It was tough for me to decide what I was going to play next because I kind of wanted to do Neo Doom, but I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure at the moment. And a lot of people were recommending me uh, to play the, the two big ones, the two big ones that everyone wants me to play, the Scythe ones and the Hell Revealed ones. And I'll get to them someday, but not just yet. I don't want to play them just yet. I have a few other things I want to do first, but they will happen. Don't worry. So I'm getting a bit sidetracked again. Uh, point of this is... I did want to do Neo Doom, but I wasn't sure whether to do it with Complex and LCA or just Vanilla, because it's a WAD that has a lot of custom stuff in it. So, like Beyond Reality, like I did before, you could do it Vanilla and have your own little experience with it, because it's not completely Vanilla Doom. It's It's got its own stuff, so it's like its own mod, and it's got custom enemies and weapons and shit like that. And you know what? I've never actually played it, so... I mean, I've tested around a little bit on the first few maps to fuck around, but I've never actually played it properly. I know this WAD because I used to play it online with Complex and LCA, etc. on the servers before. It was a semi-popular, like not as popular as Alien Vendetta and Epic 2, but Neo Doom was another one of those ones that were up there that I played quite a bit. And I used to host servers with Neo Doom in it as well. So, um, yeah, and I had a lot of fun with that, and I always wanted to do it, so... And play the original game, uh... So yeah, I wasn't sure whether to do it, and I know a lot of people come in, they want me to play shit with Complex and LCA, and they're going to be like, oh, dislike, what the fuck is this shit, come on, why is there no Complex? But fucking chill, relax, because I said in the last one, when I uh, finished Icarus, I said, um, if I do Neo Doom, would you like me to do it vanilla, or with Complex, or both? And most of the responses I got, where people actually said something about it, they said either I don't mind, or both, so... Both it is. I'm going to do this one first, and then in the future, we're going to return and revisit Neo Doom with a simplified version of the mod, so it's just the maps, no custom stuff, so I can play it with Complex and LCA in the future. But now, I'm going to be playing this as it is, and it's going to be uh, not blind, because I know all the maps, but I don't know the custom stuff, so it's going to be semi half blind. That makes it cover one eye. That, that's how I'm going to play it. Half blind. I don't know. I don't know how to do what i got to do. And I know there's like an inventory system that I need to customise as well. I might do that at some point as well. But we've got to get into it. So, um... I don't know. The music has fucking stopped a long time ago. Because it doesn't want to wait for my fucking ass talking. The music be like, you know, I'm not fucking... I'm just out of here. I can't bother with this guy fucking talking for like half an hour. Relax. Okay. Fuck. And... I said this before, but I'm going to say it again because it's very important to stress to you guys that watch this so you understand how it feels for me. Whenever I do a part one of a gameplay series, and it's been months, it's really difficult for me to start it and take that first step because there's always more things I want to address and explain, and I don't want to fuck it up, and I want to say it properly and not forget anything, you know? So, um... It's really tricky for me, and I keep procrastinating and putting it off another day, like, oh, maybe not today. Maybe not today. I, I sneezed. Okay, I'm injured. I can't play it now. <laughs> but I keep putting it off because the first part is always the hardest for me. Once I get the first part up on YouTube, I'm on a roll. I get the ball rolling, and then we, we just carry on. I just play the game. I be myself. And there's a bunch of other things I can talk about, but I'll just be stuck here on this fucking title screen for another 10 minutes. So I'll try and address these things while we play. Because I know people don't like to sit there and fucking watch this screen for fucking ages. So we're going to get into it. Ooh, oh yeah, there's something I've got to address about this. There's something I've got to mention. The custom sound effects, custom monsters, custom graphics, you know, all that stuff. Weapons, lovely stuff. Listen to this. Ooh, and listen. Hear that? Oh, okay, I'll stop. There's something fucking stupid now. I just wanted to say that the sound effect for when you take the menu off, it has that, that GoldenEye 64 menu sound. Yeah, I, I know. I rec I always recognise those sound effects. Even if they're stock ones, I recognise. Okay, let's get into it now. Stop fucking around. Alright, Guru Only, because the difficult levels. We've got Cheap Ass, Don't Help Me, Let's Do Something, Guru Only, and Kamikaze, and that's Nightmare, so... You already know, we're always going to play on Ultra Violence, but here it's called Guru Only, and I am a fucking guru, okay? I'm blowing my horn now. Alright, 
So yeah, map one, and I gotta introduce the interface. We got this custom HUD here, and we also have an inventory system, or inventory, or how the fuck you say that bloody word, it fucks me up. We, we have a custom that thing, but we, we can't see it yet because I haven't actually got any items, but it works quite similarly to Complex. You get items and you can use them and save them for certain occasions. Enemies drop them, could be health, armor, invulnerability, chalice, that sort of stuff. It's kind of similar. So I should be familiar with this kind of thing. Um, yeah, there are other things I do want to talk about, so I might want to address them really quickly just before we start. I have done the San Andreas Six Months of Mayhem remake and the MTASA, me and my buddy Henry playing online, and that has my voice and commentary, so it's funny stuff. You might want to check it out, so if you haven't checked it out and you like San Andreas and you want to see me play San Andreas, go and watch those, because they exist and stuff, so in case you missed those, go check them out. I've worked really hard on putting them together, so I'd appreciate, you know. And if you can't watch Six Months of Mayhem because the copyrights fucked you up and you can't watch it on mobile or whatever, you can go and watch it on my VidMe channel. Link in the description, link in the description, and link in the description, okay? Is that all good? Okay, let's go. Right! <laughs> Neo Doom, let's doom it! Oh, that was terrible. Um, so we're going to be going through this. Uh, for this first part, I think I want to do the first three maps, but I don't know how hard this is. I, I hear that it might be quite tricky. But after playing Complex LCA, maybe it'll be really easy. I don't know. We'll see. Let's find out. So we grab... This is Armor Shard. Small Medicines. That's like health bonuses. Yeah, that's right. Armor bonuses. And notice this This looks... It, there's a lot of sprites and sound effects that are used in Complex as well. They're not from Complex, but they're used in it. And there's a lot of things, like here's the little armor pickup in Complex. And I'll keep recognizing and noticing these things. So I apologize in advance if I keep bringing up fucking Complex and I'm not playing with it. But, oh, I'm sure some people are familiar with Neo Doom. I forgot to talk about like the fucking wad and shit. And made by Daniel, Daniel Lemos or whatever. It came out in 2006 kind of a well-known wad for its time, it's got a lot of interesting shit in it, and I'm pretty sure you can, you're supposed to jump in it, so I've allowed jumping on, as you can see, and crouching, because I'm pretty sure you're supposed to jump in certain parts of the maps you can jump to get to places. So, uh, if, unless there's something else I want to fucking talk about, here we go, for reals this time. So, map one's pretty simple, landing base, we hit this switch, go through here, it's going to be one of those where I direct you throughout it. Okay, so the zombies in this aren't actually zombies. The sound effects they make is like, Hey you! Him over there! Get him! And shit like that. So they're like soldiers, like living soldier people. And there's all sorts of custom enemies using well, D-Hacked, I think it's called, or whatever. And of course, yes, there's the rats. The all, the all lovely rats across the floor. Now, I, I'm pretty sure they do actually hurt you, so you've got to be careful with these bastards. Watch out. Okay, um... Oh, okay, yeah, we're gonna have plenty of that going on. Oh, okay, just, yeah, grab everything I can grab. So the thing is, you get, like, these health items. Some of them are, like, med kits. You just pick them up, and they give you health. But the ones these guys drop, you say, woo see? And you've got to use them, see, down there in your inventory, inventory shit. You've got to use them and accordingly. And I don't know, like, I know the health and armor, obviously, but I don't know how much each one does. Because, you know, you've got the flask, the stim pack, and the med kit, 5, 10, 20, 15, or whatever. But... I don't know how much these ones do, and there's other items that I don't know what they do either, so I'm very new to this. I think I didn't really prepare very well for this, and I haven't got my, like, if you, if you look at this, it's got its own keys for the inventory. So we have separate keys for the Doom inventory, like the, the typical one. Where is it? There it is. You've got the typical, the, the standard Doom inventory for any mod, which I've got keys set for, but you've got to set other keys for the Neo Doom inventory down here. So if I change it to that, it would be fucked up and I can't do that. So I've got to find other keys to use them. Or, I might not have to use them at all because I could just scroll along it like this. I don't know. I'll work it out by the next part. I'll have a little fuck around and customise the shit. But for now, Let's just press on and see if we can do it without using too many items. I can still use them if I want, but you know, fucking hell, I'm talking so much. Alright. Yeah, so the pistol, as you notice, is kind of an interesting one. It's, it's like the same pistol as the Doom one, but it's at a different angle, so you can kind of see the gun better. Because that's my one thing about the Doom vanilla pistol, which you can't really... It kind of just looks like a round shape because of the, the angle it's, it's at. I, I don't know. Ooh, we've got a life bottle. Don't know what that is. Probably like a stim pack sort of item. Fucking barrels. You know how I am with the barrels. Gotta blow them up. I think I just hit someone, yeah. Right, watch out for the zombies. So we've got shotgunners. They're just the vanilla shotgunners. I don't really get it. And at first I thought I thought my version was broken. I was like, fucking stop. 
I thought my version was broken or something, but I checked out gameplay on YouTube, existing walkthroughs and stuff, and the mod. I tried GZ Doom, I tried other source ports, but as far as I know, this is how it's supposed to be. So, we have a few vanilla monsters up in here, like imps and the shotgunners. Ooh, I fucked him up. But one thing I've really noticed about this is that the uh, zombies, or all the humans, or whatever you want to call them, because they're, that's how I make all the humanoid monsters, they're, like, more accurate. They're super accurate now. It's like almost every time they shoot, they hit you somehow. I, I don't know. It's just... They've made them stronger. It's every fucking time they shoot, I'm going to get hit, so I have to be a lot more careful in this with dodging the hit scans. Hit scans are going to be a serious bitch in this shit. Alright, relax. Let's get a zombie there. Element of surprise, we need to get them before they come out at me. There's more. Okay, so this pistol is extremely I just fucking ran out and I got I got more bullets, here we go. So this is extremely tedious. Let me try and kill this fucking thing. Oh, oh. oh he fucking hurt me! See look, if you if you shoot him, they start biting you back. Those motherfuckers are, are not playing they're playing dirty, dirty rats. Okay. Alright, what else we got? Oh, we've got these fuckers around here. Oh, I've got an armor shard again. Brought the barrel. The barrel. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. A bit of gib up in this bitch. That's what I'm saying. Watch out for the hit scanner. So it's going to be like that. Remember when, when I played through Beyond Reality? It's going to kind of be like that, but there's even more custom stuff in this. The music, i got to say, is another thing that I'm unfamiliar with. Let's see if I can block that down. Fuck off. This fucking pistol is inaccurate as shit. They, they, they buffed the accuracy of the humanoids, but they, they nerfed the accuracy of my pistol. So this is going to be one hell of a challenge. So yeah, the music I'm also unfamiliar with because... Kill this guy first. The, the thing about the music is I'm very, uh, I'm very confused about the music because there's a set... All the music in this WOD, Daniel made himself as well as WOD, so that's incredibly talented and well done. But the thing is, in the WOD file, there's like a separate set of music. So there's like MIDI's and then there's MUS file, I don't know. There's like a separate set of music for the whole WOD, and you never get to hear it in this. So I don't know how, how it makes any sense, but with the simplified map set that I play with Complex, that's just the maps, it has that, that other music used in it. So I've only ever heard that other music. That may sound completely fucking confusing to you. I don't know how you're supposed to understand that, but you just gotta, like, try and understand. If you've played these ones, you'll know what I mean. There's like a separate set of music, but this is like the normal set. So I've never really heard this music before, so it's, even the music is new to me. Alright, so we finally get another gun, called the handgun, even though the sprite looks like a Tech 9 submachine gun kind of thing. It says you got the handgun, and what happens when you lift it up? It's a fucking rifle. It shoots like a rifle. And it takes shotgun shells, so it's a, it's, it's called a handgun. It looks like a submachine gun Uzi when you pick it up. It, it shoots like a rifle, and it takes shotgun shells. What the fuck is this thing? Seriously. And, and to make matters worse, the shotgunners that they have here, that's still vanilla shotgunners, they call them handgun zombies. That's why I originally thought this was broken. Like this wad wasn't like the most recent one, or some, or Zandronum was fucking it up somehow. Like something wasn't compatible with. No, no. This is this is how it's supposed to be apparently. So fuck it. I'm going with it. All right. Yeah, you you watch out. If you spent if you spent less time saying watch out and watching out for yourself, you wouldn't get killed. Maybe. Okay, so as you can see, like a lot of the sprites, like look, that's the that's the flask from Complex. But that's okay because it's a, it's a different thing altogether here. All right, I've got to try and use the pistol more than the uh, handgun because it's got limited shell ammo, and I need to save it for for stronger monsters that come up. In these earlier levels, we've got to deal with a lot more. Uh, I can't even call them zombies. I, this is gonna be very confusing. We've got to deal with a lot more humanoid enemies. A lot of hit scanners, so we've got to stick with the pistol as much as we can until we get to the stronger enemies that we have to use the handgun again. Can I just call it the shotgun? I'm just gonna call it the shotgun because that's essentially what it is. It's the fucking shotgun. Okay, watch out. Ooh, the PlayStation Doom. Oh, the play the PSX Doom zombie sound. Chill. Okay. Okay, don't use any more. You've got to save it. Oh my god. Watch out. Kill these hit scanners first before I say anything else. There we go. So it shoots slightly... Fucking die. It shoots slightly faster than the Doom shotgun, so that's nice. And I think it's about the same power. It, it, it's about the same damage. So, um... Here's a chainsaw guy. And he will fucking saw me if he gets up to me, so I've got to take care of him. He's got hundreds, so... 
Ooh, see, look, it's, it's, it's not quite, maybe not quite as powerful as Doom Shotgun, but I think it's, it's almost on par. But it's faster, so I can't complain too much. It's just that the ammo gets a bit limited. Let me try topping up my health. Let me try that. There we go. Oh, right, right. It's all the same sound effects. God, it's it's a lot more familiar to me than I'm used to. All right. So there's armor in there. There's a little secret, and I'm sure that there's a way of getting it. And I'm I sure I I knew. Is it this? Oh, it's that. Okay. Over there. Hey, yeah, fuck you. Get this shit. I got a bottle. I got a bottle. What's in the bottle? Is it? Ooh. There we go. We got the secret. We got the armor. Uh, what armor was that? Aluminium armor, or aluminum, as you Americans like to call it. What's in here? What the fuck is that? Oh, it's a knife. Oh, okay. Oh, sweet. Oh, look at that. I got a dagger. All right, here we go. Let's stab some bitches. I'm assuming this is the chainsaw replacement, so... Yeah, I don't want to use it here, because these guys are fuck me up. There we go. There we go. Ooh. What's that? What did he drop there? Auto-detect my... Oh, so we got landmines in this as well, and I think I set it to a certain button as well. If it's B, like my normal... Oh, no? Let me try and use it. Hang on. No? The fuck? How do I use them? So this is what I don't understand. How do I use the mines? I don't... Did I lay it? No. How the fuck do I do it? I don't know how you do it. Hang on. No, I see, I don't know how to fucking do it. So this is what I'm going to have to figure out outside this gameplay. Because I can't be playing through the whole world like this not knowing how to use the items. Because I'm pretty sure it's not like you can just play through the world and not use any items. Sometimes they'll be crucial to use. So i got to watch out with that. So I've got plenty of bullets. This is tedious as fuck, but we got to do it. Oh. oh, fucking hell. So, another thing. What was that? Fucking snowflake? What's that? Hang on. Another, there's a few other things I could talk about. I've been playing some other wads. You know, offline casually. I've been, I've been fucking around with a few things, you know? Grab that. Oh, I don't need any health. What is that? Profane spirit. Can I use it? Woo. Can I, I can't use anything. What the fuck? Right, I'm going to have to figure that out later. So, yeah, fuck it up. See, I was playing... Um, I, play, I tried out Dark Tartarus, and a lot of people recognize that name, I'm sure. A lot of people know that word. And I tried playing a bit of it. You cannot play it with Complex, right? That's all I'm saying. You cannot play it with Complex and LCA. It is basically Slaughter mixed with... Well, it's Slaughter, but it's got like some interesting maps as well. But it's one of those ones where it's only just possible to play vanilla. So if you add mods to it, like Brutal or Complex, it will make it impossible. It's not possible, right? So... And when I was playing it, it took me so fucking long just to complete the first map. So I felt like, oh, you know what? This might be something I could do in a live stream. Now, I'm, not, I'm gonna get you hyped by talking about fucking live streams again, because I keep bringing it up all the time. I'm still not doing it yet, but so soon it will happen. I have been discussing it a little more, asking about how the fuck I'm supposed to do it and set it up and stuff. So soon we are getting this much closer to me doing the live streams, and I'm sure you'll enjoy that, because we can just hang out have a good time, you know, chill and shit, and uh, Dark Tartarus, I felt, was a wad that would be suitable for live streams because it takes so fucking long for me to do it, and it's one of those ones where you could kind of help me out a little bit with how to do it stuff. Also, it's blind because I've never played before, so yeah, it's an ideal choice, but anyway, on with this. This is the problem with not doing, like, an update video or something. Is that when people do, like if I did a little update video, just say, "Hey guys, I haven't been I haven't been working on a video yet, but soon, blah blah blah, because of so and so." Instead of doing that, I try and stuff it all into the next part of the gameplay. So this is why it gets a little sidetracked with talking because I don't I just, I just don't do it. So I end up trying to say everything in this while trying to play at the same time, and in, in turn, it gets me fucked up. Just relax, put this back. So yeah, from what I, I did fuck around with this one a little bit, just to, just to test, dip your toe in the water sort of thing, just to test out, you know, and make sure it's all running okay, and the compatibility, and so and so. So I played the first couple of maps, just fucking around a little bit, and what, I, what I've learned is, you've got to be, say, space, what the fuck am I saying? You've got to be uh, sparing with the ammo use, you've got to be careful, use the pistol as much as you can, and save, ooh, a diskette. Kind of reminds me of Goldeneye again, diskette. You've got to save the shells when you can and sort of, you know, try and use the pistol as much as possible until you get a chain gun or something. And really try and save that health and use them items because you need them. So I, I have a feeling this wad might be a bit trickier than I thought initially because it's not just vanilla doom easy shit. There's a lot more to it than that. So, you know, we'll just keep going and do the shit. I don't know what to say, but. Alright, this is the exit room. 
the blacks. See, I've got the I've got the upper hand advantage by knowing all the maps. I know all the maps and how to do them, but I don't know how the monsters work, the items work, the weapons, etc. So all that will be a new learning curve for me. All right. So now before we take the exit or the two x one seven, whatever the fuck that says, some alien shit. We're gonna try and get outside there and figure out our secret because there is a secret. You can go outside. I think, yeah, there we go, it's open. See, what you can do is do a combination of the jump and crouch, Clams. like this, Clams. and then get yourself out the window, but that's cheating. We're not doing that. We're taking the, the uh, intended route, like this. Oh, God, okay, here's the uh, demon type. So, like, I don't know I don't know if they're much stronger. Or, I think they're a bit faster. I'm not, I can't tell. I think they're about the same. But they're basically just the same as the usual pinkies, but they're, they're grey, and they have some interesting new sound effects, which I kind of like. Listen. Listen. That's a pretty cool sound effect. All right, let's get in with this. Bah, bah, there we go. Two shots. So, is it more powerful than a shotgun? This shit don't make no sense to me. Because you take some, between two and three hits, but I, I don't... I don't know. Sometimes it seems less powerful, sometimes more. I don't know how it works. See, look, oh no, it's about the same. I've got, I don't know. Finish them off with that. There we go. All right, so what we got here? Rocket? Yeah, it's a rocket. Okay. It looks like a fucking foam dart that people throw in, like, summertime or whatever. Um, oh, there's another one in the back. Okay. But, but, oh, I missed that shot completely. There we go. Okay, finish them off with this. Got to save them shells. There we go. All right. So this, this is a nice looking rocket launcher. Look at that. Looks like a proper one. All right, so let's have a look at it. And it is the rocket launcher from Blood. All right, that's that's fine. Whew. Um, and I also noticed um, the sound effect for when you get the secret, the little blue shit, little fucking Sherlock Holmes Cluedo shit. I don't know, that's what it makes me think of. That's what it reminds me of, I don't know. I'm pretty sure that was used in Who Done It as well. Pits bitch. Ooh. Oh, he got me a, whoa, whoa. What the fuck that was. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was using Who Done It, and that's what I recognise it from. Either that, or it was um, a, a what I played fucking ages ago, like Doom Raider or something like that. There's some really cool sound effects like that in this world, and it's it's really really cool. All right, so uh, I think that's pretty much everything. Yes, it is. Okay, let's exit. Oh, perfect. Yes, yes gonna skip that real quick okay so I have spent over 20 minutes already but that's okay because it's only to be expected in a part one you, sh you guys should know this by now whenever I do a part one there's a fuckload of talking and shit to say all right so that's understandable but from the part two onwards we get right into the shit so that's how it's gonna be um hopefully I'll be able to do at least two maps then if I can't do three I'll do two hopefully we'll take on the second one all right so notice here how there's no um uh, entering screen so you don't actually get to see the name of the next map uh, until you do that obviously but you don't it doesn't tell you it, it, just, it just goes straight to it so that's a little shit cut out it's a little more fast paced um okay so i got to bring this up now what we're going to do here this is not a pistol start challenge and because the, the reason why is because i tried to do that i tried to pistol start a couple of maps i just picked some maps at random when i was uh testing the compatibility before I started recording and holy shit it is no joke it is definitely not intended to be pistol side and some of the maps are near enough impossible to pistol start because so many of the monsters are so strong and you don't get many weapons in the map so I'm pretty sure it was intended to be uh, saved along the way so what we're gonna do is like beyond reality we're gonna save it to most people will be acting like I'm fucking anti-save or something. I am for the most part, but there are times when it is acceptable to use it. And because there's no randomizer in this uh, wad, or mod, or whatever the fuck you want to, you know, in this wad, there's no randomized placements of monsters, so saving it won't fuck up anything. So it's perfectly fine to save it. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh, what am I doing? I'm fucked. There's save game. Get out. I like it's called get out. All right. Ugh, so Hexa was uh, beyond reality, but we're just going to call it uh, Neo Doom now because if I name them all Hexa, I'm going to get very fucking confused. We're just going to call it Neo Doom. All right, so just saved your game. Yes, thank you for telling me that. All right, um, so we're on our map two, Poison Refinery, not to be confused with Toxin Refinery. Fuck's sake, all refinery. A lot of Doom maps are processing. Remember that TNT processing? They use that word a lot. There's so many of the same fucking keywords. That's okay. Ooh, okay, relax, relax. We're gonna try and, like I said, save it as much as possible. Okay, grab that. 
you got an extra pistol. So what, this basically takes up another one of the uh, two slots in the pool. That motherfucker is loud. So we now get a Kimbo, as you may want to call it, which isn't the technical term, but you know, you get dual wielding pistols. There we go. So we got a slightly faster fire rate. Fuck them up. There we go. Slightly faster firing rate. It's still all fucking hell. Get him with a the shotgun. Ugh. There we go. Just to take off most of his health. Got slightly faster firing rate. It's still not quite a chain gun, but it's much better than the one pistol. And now there's no need to use it again, now that we have the dual wield. Okay, so let's just grab everything. Yep. Hopefully we'll get our chain gun soon, because using these weapons it's incredibly uh, uh, tedious, slow paced and lackluster. Hopefully we'll get some stronger weapons soon. I don't want to use that rocket launcher yet, in case of, I'm saving it for like special shit. Like a massive group of monsters or something like that. Alright, so yeah. And yeah, that's just the way it is. Got this armor? No? I don't need that? Okay, fine. So yeah, if I pistol started, then it would be so fucking hard and pointless. And it, I don't want to do a pistol start challenge on this anyway, because I'm going to do a pistol start challenge when I play through the maps with Complex and LCA. It will be done, don't you worry. But I want to play this one as it was intended, so we're just going to be going along and saving as we go. Alright? Alright. Fucking hell am I talking. I need a drink already. Ooh. So the chain gunners are basically vanilla. Except, yet again, I'm sure they're more accurate, like these other guys. They're all more accurate. And my guns are fucking shit accuracy, so I've got to be really careful. Relax. Watch out! Get him, get him, get him! Ooh, don't get fucked up now. Ooh, that's... Okay, so let me get this straight. These are like the med kits, and the ones that look like the stim packs, the horizontal shaped ones. But they're not in your inventory, you pick them up. So the, these these were the flasks, but in this wad they are the med kits. So if you pick these up, you get like 25 health. So don't fucking waste it if you got 95 health and pick up one of these shits. All right, you, I got to remember that. All right, get all this. I noticed that I haven't got a backpack. I'm not sure how the ammo system works because I've got more than 50 and I haven't got a backpack. I don't know if you do get backpacks at all or if it goes past 100 to 200. I have no idea how it works. So I'm just gonna play as I go. Just try and save as much ammo as I can. Alright, so, get these guys with this shit. He's down there. I got him? I got him. Okay. Right, that's okay. That's fine. We got that. Get these guys. Alright. Where, where are they at? I know there's more. Shoot that! Quick! Yes! There we go. Fucking die! These pistols that... Oh, they're a lot weaker than you think. There we go. And he was pretty weak too. So we're going to leave these barrels out because these guys are going to come out. It's going to be no joke. Watch out! Ooh. Ooh. No! Okay, relax, use this. I want that chain gun soon. I want to keep using this shit all day. Okay. So be smart, pick him off here, look. There we go. There we go. There's a guy behind this barrel. Whoa! Oh, I must have given like two of them there. Alright, relax. We get more. There's more. There we go. Alright, we're doing well so far. Okay. Oh my god, there's one there. Ooh. Hey. Ooh! Two for the price of one, that's what I'm talking about. Okay. I've really got to learn how to use these auto-detect mines because I could just lay them here because there's a trap that comes out when I pick up the key. I need to know how to fucking use them. I can't fucking use the shit. I need to figure it out. I'll, I'll do it by the next part. I should figure it out. But for now, we got to just use this. Right, let the demons... Yeah, and there's pinkies. I can't really call them pinkies. There's demons at the back. Alright. Also, I think a bit of infighting is necessary as well, because ammo is relatively scarce, so we might need to use a bit of infighting as well. Shoot that barrel. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. Bit of that up in here. Right. They're infighting, that's good. Bah, 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 ah, ah. There we go. Okay, that was pretty good, I'm quite happy with that. We get some more ammo here. You know how I do, I've got to get rid of all the fucking barrels. But be careful though, because I don't want to waste all my ammo trying to shoot them. Just make sure I don't miss them all the time. And try and collect as much as you can. Okay, I've got full shotgun shells now. You know what? I'm going to do this. Right. Grab that. There we go. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, so now we're going to take our chances in here. Ooh, you watch out, bitch. Oh, I didn't blow up the barrel. I'm trying to blow it up. Let this guy come closer. I'm going to blow up the barrel on his ass. Ooh, I love doing that. that shit's awesome. Okay, grab the kit. Right, what's that? There we go, pick that up. Bandage, it's called a bandage, okay. No, block the barrel! Oh, for fuck's sake! Right, shoot that. 
Fuck him up. Fuck him up. There we go. Where did the barrel go? Did I blow it up? Okay. Oh, oh. Demon, all right. See, you gotta, you gotta do that. You gotta do the whole strategy thing. You gotta know what guns to use for what monster. There we go. Okay, we're doing it though. We're doing just fine. It's a lot easier than I thought it would be. As long as we just be careful. There we go. Oh, I'm trying to get two for the price of one again. I'm fucking up. There we go. Alright. Oh, 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 another demon. That's fine. We got him. Alright. This. Gotta compromise with the ammo. See, look. Don't want to waste the whole shell on that one bullet. There we go. We're doing it. And I'm, I noticed that when you pick up the box of bullets, it's the same sound effect as when you use the ammo satchel. Okay, I'll stop. I'll stop. I keep recognizing the ship. Sorry. Alright. Hit him. There we go. Help me out here. And then fuck him up. Oh, he's still alive. What? Die. Alright, there we go. Fuck this guy up. Get the ammo. Uh, the health. Ammo. It's ammo for your life. That's what it is. Fucking blow up. Ah! <laughs> that was good. Alright. It's all about the barrels as well. Try and get them with barrels as much as you can. Got to make use with of other means of destruction. Okay, I've got that profane spirit again. I guess the spirit is uh, very rude and swears a lot if you're going to call it profane. No? Okay, I'll stop. Um, there I am. There they are. There's only one dude. It's just me on my own. You know, look. Look, it's just me. I, I don't know. I don't get it. Maybe it was designed for multiplayer. So when when there's more than one player, they say there they are because there's more than one. Maybe I don't know. That didn't do shit. All right, fuck them up. Ooh. Okay, here we go. Um, there's a caca demon around here somewhere, aren't there? Isn't there? Fuck. Can they not shoot each other? They don't seem to really shoot. The hit scanners don't really seem to be getting each other. I don't know. All right, there we go. I'm gonna use some shotgun shells on that uh, caco now. When he comes out. Ooh, these guys as well, don't forget. Yeah. Oh, there he he's out. Let's grab that. I love the sound effects in this one. It's really cool, techy, futuristic shit. All shit like that. I love it. Okay, where's that capo? Yeah, I don't know what he does. Does he like a super shot or something? Let's see. Ooh. Okay, yeah, he just attacks normally. Alright. All right, fuck him up. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's, that's easy enough. I could do that. Get rid of this bitch. You already know. Got to get rid of all the barrels. All right, got my shells back on full. Good, good. We got some goggles here. Oh, blue. Oh, I like that sound. It's nice. It makes me feel like I've, I've, I've found a clue or something. You know, I feel very, again, Sherlock Holmesy sort of. Oh, magnifying glass, moustache, deerstalker hat. I don't know. What is it about that sound that makes me think of that? I don't know. But yeah, I got the goggles now, and I don't really use them, so I'll just use them now just to demonstrate. So yeah, they have this little blue haze effect. That's part of the wad itself. I still have my settings on to uh, not use the green shit enhanced mode. So yeah. All right, so we get the blue key now. But this guy's in there. Watch out. Get rid of the barrels. You know, I gotta do it. The OCD. Come on, go. There's a lot of imps back. Oh fuck. Okay. That's alright, we've got plenty of shells now because we saved them in the first map in the beginning of this one, so we can use them. Look, there we go, see? At this rate, we won't even need to do any infighting because we've got plenty of ammo for them. There we go. Why are the sound effects, man? I love it. I love the sound design in this. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. Alright, save that. Stick back with this. Oh, no, hang on, there's more. Oh, yep, that's it, fight. That's it. Yep, do what you gotta do. Ah, oh, I wanted to get... Oh, I, I always tend to get impatient with him fighting. I always try and shoot them just before they die, so I kill both of them at once. Sometimes it does not work. Alright, so that's that's our uh, soul sphere, I'm pretty sure that is. It's like a sort of flask thing. I don't know. I think it's that making that sound as well. It might be. Alright, so we've got more fuckers in here. Haha, <laughs> this is quite a tricky room, actually, so I better make sure I do this right. That motherfucker shot me around the corner again. Relax. But stop! Oof, I better get this guy though. There we go. There we go. That's it. Alright, chill with that. Use a bit of this. Yeah, okay. It's very slow, but you've got to bear with me, guys. It's a very slow start. But I think the way the WOD works, it's not like Beyond Reality. See, it's, Beyond Reality was only like 15 or so maps. It's only like half a WOD. This is a full Mega WOD, so... If it's going to have custom weapons, it's going to have a progression to it. You're not going to get all the BFGs and everything off the bat of the first few maps. We, it has to be 
it has to take its time getting there. So the first few maps are going to be very pistol and shotgun oriented, very shoot and simple stuff, and very tedious, you know, but, 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 you know, all that. Before we get to the boom, boom, and all that shit, that will come up later. But for now, we're just going to keep but, 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 like this. Alright, here we go. Still going. There's a barrel down there. Let me, let me try and use the barrel. Hang on. Oh. Oh, wait, wait! Get the barrel. Ooh. No, wait, 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 wait for them to come closer and then... Bitch, blow up! There we go. Fucking hell, the barrels seem a lot stronger than they usually are. Either that or the pistols are super weak. I don't know. <laughs> Fucking die, boss. Fucking weak shit. Again. Right, get these guys. <sighs> Nimble footing, that's what we're talking about. There we go. Some imps over here. We've got some shotgun shells up there, so that's good. Alright. Yeah, you want some? There you go. Pick that up. Yep. Yeah. Okay, we've got all our shells again. Get rid of that. Okay, so here, we're going to want to keep these barrels because this is another uh, key trap. It's one of those wads. We're going to do a lot of key traps. This is going to open up enough. From what I remember, there's like a bunch of cacos in there or something. So let's just be careful. Whoop. All right. I don't think we need this one, though. This, this one's not needed. All right. So what we have to do is like a sort of... Um, we go in here, don't we? Is it, is it in here? It's something like that. Is there a switch? It's one of these shits, I, I don't remember. Mm. Either that or there's a, like, like a switch somewhere that I've got hit. Yeah, there's a switch up there. See, it's a bit confusing because this is actually a switch texture. When these are just normal wall computer face textures, but this is actually a switch. So whenever you see that, that line of alien text shit, it's actually a switch. Alright, here we go. Oh, and also another thing I gotta address, I have tweaked just tweaked my Michael Rosen skin just a little bit so that from now on you'll hear this. You'll hear the uh, land sound effect from GTA 3. You know, when you jump and clawed lands, it goes with his feet. I added that because um, I noticed this, I would say, bug or issue with the skin where Michael would say nice really, really loudly for, for some reason whenever it was the first time he lands on, on the ground, in the first time. And all the rest of the nice is a normal volume. And what I realized was there's a grunt sound and a land sound. And he's saying both of them at the same time. So one of them he does when he just lands. And the other one he does when he falls from a higher distance and lands. So he'll do both if it's high enough. Plums. Nice. See, he, he does the boom and the nice at the same time. So I couldn't get it to go the other way around. So it's just that. So I had to do something. Because it's better than him just saying nice really loudly for no fucking reason. I knew there was something wrong with it and I'd always been meaning to fix it, but now I kind of have. Now it does the footstep sound, Plums. Nice. which is more accurate. I, I, I like it because it gives him a little more realism because he's got feet. Contrary to popular belief in YouTube poops, you know, he does have legs. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Oh, we've got lost souls. Alright, just, just vanilla ones. Quite simple. Let me not waste that one. Yeah, stick with that. Ugh, I can't get him in one hit. Shotgun not gonna do a hundred damage, is it? I can't is... Oh, oh I it's can't a lift! <sighs> I fucking missed it. Okay, relax. Just gotta wait for the lift to come back down. How y'all doing? <laughs> do, 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 do. I never really paid attention to the music so far. I can't really hear it because of my ass talking so much, but you know, it, it, it's pretty good. Especially considering the guy made the wad and the music at the same time. There's only a few wads that have that. That's some serious talent. Alright, here we go. I know there's a secret around here. I know my secrets, and I know there's one around here. Alright, relax. Ooh, there it is. Okay, so we've got this sort of red armor. Maybe it's like the demonic armor. I don't know. We'll see. We pick it up. Ah! I can't get me one hit. Chill. Alright, so that is how to get the key. Even though technically you can jump to it, and I'll show you that in a minute. Okay, so how do we get this secret in here? Here we go. Quite obvious. Right, then. Okay, titanium armor. Yeah, babe. Okay, yeah, babe. Mm. Speaking of babe, we'll be getting to that in a little while. There's a certain enemy in this ward that's a bit um kinky, I would say. <laughs> Those of you who know this ward know what I'm talking about, but we'll get to her soon, all right? Um, but for now, we're just dealing with these guys. So we, this is how you're supposed to get the key, but you can actually jump to it, because look, watch this. Okay, wait, wait, hang on. 
clams. Ugh, see, look, you can just bypass the whole thing. And before you say you're not supposed to jump, you are supposed to jump in this one, okay? I'm, I promise you, and I will show you in future parts, there are places in the uh, maps where you have to jump to be able to get up a ledge or something. There's no way around it. You have to be able to jump. So I'm sure, because I, I keep saying this because there was this one time I hosted the server and there was this guy who was like, why is jumping on? Turn it off. And it's like, you're supposed to jump, I swear. I, it may break, not the map, but it might break some of the flow of the map here and there. And like the windows in the first map. But I know for a fact you're supposed to jump. I know it. All right, here we go. Get the nice. key. To the yellow access diskette, or the key as I like to call it, because it's a lot easier to say. We've got some guys around the corner. All right, barrels away. <laughs> Don't get trapped. I'm getting trapped. Don't die. Good jump. I keep forgetting. I, don't forget you can jump, so I can get out of a sticky situation if I just jump. I might want to use my health now. Hang on, this, this is good practice. I've got to use my health. Alright. But, but, but these, are, these are just stim packs. They look like big fucking med kits. They're like stim packs. What does this one do? What, what does that do? What did I get? What the fuck was that? What did that get? Oh, oh, I got super speed. What the fuck? Okay, so that's what that is. I don't know what it was called or what it is, but it get, it's like a jar of fucking marmalade or something in the top right corner of my screen. And it gives me super speed. Fucking hell, this is a Michael Rosen skin, not a Mark Sabine one. Well, I'll take it. I'll take the haste. I don't know. Right. It's not really going to do anything for me, but I'll take it. I'll just keep shooting them up. Fuck them up. Fuck them up. You already know how we do. Fucking them up. Run through. Ooh, almost got fucked on the door. Run through. How long does the speed last? Lasts in quite a long time. Maybe it's till the end of the whole. Maybe it's like the whole map, like Berserk. I don't know. Well, with this power up, you can certainly go get over there. Look, look at that. See, it's not even about breaking the map. They let you do that shit. It doesn't matter. All right. Yeah, I've got all my health up. Okay. Get that. Get them shells. That's it. Nice. All right. So go in there, and now to the next part. I think that red armor serving me quite well. Fuck you. Barrel. Oh, he blew it up himself. Shit. Oh, that cheeky motherfucker. Right, hang on. Shoot him with this. Look, I can get the top of the head. Look. Relax. Okay, oh my god, he's hitting me. I the thing I noticed with this one is you die a lot quicker than you'd expect. Like, every shot and attack takes a lot more health than you think it does. So you've got to have your wits about you because you never know when they're going to hit you like three times and you're already dead. So relax. Watch out. Right, these motherfuckers stupid. How did they not hear me shooting just there? Right, there's guys around the corner as well. Yeah, I know. Like fucking, they love to put the guys around the corners. Look at this. These motherfuckers. So, look. Oh, oh. Now you want to come out? Okay, that's fine. I got you. I got you. Don't worry. Oh, this guy as well. Oh, there's another one. Watch out. Oh, there's a really good. Again, I gotta say, really good sound effects. Oh, that shit. Oh, watch out. Oh, okay. Okay. Ooh. Now, we're doing pretty good so far. We haven't died once, so I call that good in my books. There's a fucking rat that just came out. The bitch, die. Oh, the other ones are... They only bite you if you shoot them. Look, I can I can prove it. Look. Hang on, wait. Wait, wait. Hang on, hang on. All right, there you go. He's going to bite me. Watch. See? You fucking bastard. Fuck you, you little piece of rodent shit. Fucking look at look at his corpse. Look, you, you could cook that. You could use it, and it'd be like health. No, oh, never mind. All right, so this is how you get that secret with the uh, soul sphere. But we're going to top up the health first before we do that. But 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 there we go. Wow, see, it's, it's that fucking quake sound effect that every mod and wad uses for invulnerability. They always use that Bwah, shit. But that's not invulnerability. That was supercharged. That was a uh, soul sphere. That's what it is. All right. Woo. All right. Get rid of these capos. The last thing to do. Ooh, I think they fire. They uh, fire. They attack at a faster rate than your standard caco. I noticed that every single monster in the wads is like new caco demon, new zombie man, new imp. So even though they're sl they're technically vanilla monsters, they are altered in some way. That's why they've given them a whole new actor. All right. So I do a fuckload of explaining in this. I'm sorry. Spectre, new Spectre. See, look, they're slightly edited. This guy is faster. I, I can tell. All right, that's it, isn't it? That, that's it. Yeah. Okay, we did it. All right. Oh, and perfect again. How about that? That's what I'm talking about. Kick ass, fucking. 
That's a really cool intermission theme. I like that. All right, so I'm going to stop it here. I wanted to do three maps, but you knew that was never going to fucking happen. My 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 fucking ass talking so much. <laughs> But you you know, everyone who watches my shit, you should come to expect it, you know. If you want to unsubscribe because this motherfucker talked too much, that's that's your choice. But the people who stick around and actually appreciate it or don't mind it or whatever, I, that's what's up, okay? So I, so far, I'm uh, liking this, I'm liking this quite a lot. Um, I can't do I will see you, but I can because I'll have to start the map first though and then save it. Because it doesn't say next up. But yeah, this was a pretty good thing, I think. I, I hope that um, plenty of people will tune in and watch this, because I know it's not complex, but come on, still what? It's still going to be good, I promise. <laughs> it's still good. Just please watch it. All right, fucking hell. I'm fucking 666 subscribers. I saw that. Now, how appropriate is that? That's what I'm talking about. I'm pretty sure I must have that number by now. It was like 664 the other day, but 666 subscribers. Oh, you almost don't want it to change, but no, no. I, I, I would love to have more. So keep them coming, guys. Keep watching and tuning in and shit. And you already know, now that I've started a series, expect more. I'm sorry that it took me so long to get to doing another one, but now that I've started... Here we go. You're going to expect some more in the next few days. So, uh, I will see you in part two. Where? Oh my god, fucking chainsaw bastards. Quick save it. Uh, what's the quick save button? I need to remember my quick save button. I will see you in part two where we'll be taking on Command Central. Uh, guys, uh, listen. I'm just. No, fuck! <laughs>